What's going on everybody, it's your boy The Truth and today we're talking about rest week. Now these are the points where after you've been training for a certain amount of time, someone would either recommend or you feel that you need time off from the gym. It sounds all great at first, but it's not what it's all cracked up to be. And these are my five stages of rest week. Stage one, denial. So this for most people is known as a deload week. <laughs> This is where you need to get in the gym. You know you need to be out of the gym and you just need to rest, but you need to get in the gym and just do something. Probably rest week already. Probably you've been training for two years straight without a break. Like, come on, you need to just, just rest your body. It's not, it's not two years. Come on, bro, it's not two years. You're exaggerating. You're an exagger, you're an exaggerator. They relate everything to the gym. No matter what it is, no matter what you're talking about, it's related to the gym. Yeah, G, I was thinking about getting some ice cream, you know, do you want some ice cream? I'm gonna get some, maybe some pie or something as well. Or you go to that, that gym place. You know, the, the one um, in, um, oh, what's that gym called that serves the ice cream? Yeah, yeah, we can go there. <sighs> Number two, anger. <laughs> This is the uncontrolled rage of not being able to take out your rage in the gym. So you just want to destroy everything. You get angry at little things. Yo, who ate all my Nutri Game bars? Bro, you ate all of them. You ate them yesterday. Why did you let me eat them? Why did you let me eat them? You knew I was going to be hungry today, this time, at this point. Why did you let me eat them? Sorry, bro. I, I, don't, I don't even know. Stage three. Bargaining. This is the point where they want to they'll do anything to either get to the gym or simulate something from the gym. Hello, mom. Yeah, mom. When are you going food shopping? What today? Do you want me to carry your bags? I can carry your bags. You know, are you, is it a big is it a big shop or a small shop? A big shop. What well, like you're spending over a hundred pounds? Say, do you, do you want me to come and pick up the bags? I can I can I can lift the bags. Or they'll literally do anything, and I mean anything, to get back into the gym. Come on, man. Let's go, gym. Let's go gym. Oh, I got these cheeseburgers, man. I got these cheese. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? What, what are you doing? What are you doing? It's, it's been like four hours. Come on. Please, man. Just, I'll suck your d <laughs> You start saying stupid-ish, like, can I just touch the weights? I, I, I won't train. I won't train. Can I just touch the weight? Oh, I've missed you so much. I've missed you so much. Oh, we'll be reunited soon. Wait for me. You will wait for me, won't you? Yes, wait for me. And then we hit stage four, depression. Now this is the point that you're so depressed from not being in the gym that you just start eating. You start eating and you start watching Netflix. And everyone knows about the curse of Netflix. You're not getting up for days. Let's see what's on Netflix. Dexter, hmm. at Dexter's lab. Let's watch Dexter. Oh my god. I have to watch the next episode. I have to watch the next one. I have to. Of course. They can't leave it like that. Three days later. Next episode. Oh, fat. Oh, I want to go to the gym. And then finally, number five. Acceptance. You have now accepted that you have to take this rest week, but this point is dangerous because now that you've got to this point, now getting back into the gym is going to be a whole different story to the point that you need to really think about easing yourself back in. It's all mind games. It's all mind games. And all this, all this, just because you killed your workout. See what I did there? See what I did? <laughs> See what I did? See what I did? Yeah! But anyway, that's the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it too. If you relate, share with your friends across Facebook and Twitter. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the button. Hit the button. Hit the button. Leave your comments down below. Comments, comments, comments in the comment section. And I will catch you guys later. Peace. But I got these cheeseburgers, man. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I'm running, I never front it. I got my whole cool life.